Good morning. Good morning, pretty girl. Good morning. Harry Potter on TV. Luna by my side. It's a good day. So I, I just got up not too long ago. Let me turn this down just so I don't get copyright. I just got up not too long ago at like 11.45, I think. Um, I am not a night person anymore. Like, I'm not a morning person and I'm not a night person. I don't know how to explain it. Like, I was up until 3.15 or so last night because of the craft fair. So it didn't end till 2. Um, so I slept a lot today. Um, my plan is to go right now. I'm going to put Looney in her cage and I'm going to go to Target um, because as far as I know everything on Halloween clearance is 70% off and they're having a sale on trees today. Um, all trees, pre-lit trees, are 40% off. So I want to see if they have the rose gold tree that they had last year that I really liked um, because if they have the rose gold tree I will set that up in my house until we move. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go do that. So I'll see you guys at Target. I feel like I do this to myself every time I come here on like a weekend, but I utterly hate coming to Target or the mall in general on the weekend. It's always so packed and I don't like people. Ugh, people drive horribly, so. Uh, but I'm here now. Okay, so this is the tree that I wanted, you guys. It's like a rose gold pre-lit tree. I really wanted it. I figured it's really small, so it's probably not expensive. Um, no. It's $119.99, and even with 40% off, like if I do the map, if I do the math here, point four, so that's roughly $48 off, so 119, let's just do 120, 120 minus 48, that's a lot of money. I'm sorry, I can't do that. I'm not gonna get this tree. Like, it's beautiful, I've wanted it for like, two or three years now, but like there's no way. I can't afford $72 for a tree like that. So now a part of me is kind of like, why don't I get something like this? Like this is a like a pre-lit spiral tree. It's 30 bucks. They also have like a two mini pack for 30 bucks. I don't know. I'm gonna wait. Obviously like it's silly for me to get like super excited about buying stuff like this right now because we don't even know where we're gonna be or when we're moving. So <sighs> it just makes me sad because like I really, really wanted that rose gold tree over there like really bad and I did not know it was that much money like look that one's even $20 why look at this one size like it doesn't make sense I really want to get these I feel like they're made for me but a part of me thinks that I might be able to make this myself so I don't know it's 10 bucks I might get it not today but like eventually I thought these were really funny so cute look at this so cute. They're paper though, but cute. So I just left Target. Um, I have to go to get gas, and then I also have to go to Publix. Um, I haven't been to the grocery store in like, I think two weeks. I think it's literally been two weeks since I went to the grocery store, which is crazy. I never go that long. I'm at the grocery store like every other day, but ever since I've started to be more like money managing more money smart money conscientious I don't know how I want to phrase it ever since I've tried to eat more food at home like what we already have like make meals from what we have in our pantry or our freezer or our fridge um, I've really been trying to not go spend money at the grocery store or at Taco Bell or anywhere for that matter um, the other day I remember I was like I'm really hungry I'm just gonna go get like a salad from this like salad place that I go to sometimes and then I'm like you know what no I'm not I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna find something to eat at home I tell you what if you're looking for a way to shock yourself into managing your money um, and being money conscientious uh, lose your job <laughs> because that is what has like kind of knocked me uh, in this whole save money don't spend kick um, obviously I just left Target and I did buy a few things, but it's stuff that is on sale that I didn't pay full price for. It was 70% off, so I'll show you what I got when I get home. Okay, Luna, I see you have your bone, but do you want the ice cream or do you want your bone? You're not able to hold both, so which one do you want? You want your bone? You, you gotta put the bone down if you want the ice cream. <laughs> put the bone down. You'll figure it out. Come on. 
Oh girl, you figured it out. Good girl. All right, so it's time for like a miniature Target haul. So I picked this up from the dollar spot. These snowball fight things, it's like basically fluffy. Luna really wants them. They're basically fluffy balls. Um, it was $3 for this pack of 10. So then on top of those snowballs, I got the snowball slingshots. So I got two of them. I thought it would be really cute to have this sitting in like a basket, kind of like that over there. Yep, there it is. Um, and then, you know, have like the two sticks sticking out of the basket. So if someone wanted to have a snowball fight when they came inside, I thought it'd be, I don't know, just me and my weird decorating stuff. So, oh, I got a bunch of these, okay. So these were on sale. These ones specifically were 89 cents. And essentially what they are are like these like faux sticks that you would stick in like caramel apples and stuff or or even like um, cake pops. I can't think right now. So I got quite a few of these because I figured they're so cheap and they're so cute. And for 89 cents, you get 12 in a pack. So I got quite a few. Um, and then I also got these, like, generic sticks. These were 60 cents. Oh, there's another one of those. So these ones were 60 cents, and you get 30 of them for cake pop. So I like to bake. Um, I just haven't been doing it as often as I used, used to do it. So this was, like, one of the only things that I got um, besides that on clearance. It was the light bulb that I've been wanting, like, the entirety of the Halloween season. Um, I got it for 70% off, so what was that, $1.80 or something? But it's like a light bulb that has like a faux fire flicker, um, so I got that. I did get two um, Christmas things. This was a sign that says, let's get lit. Um, I'm having a Christmas party this year with my friends, so I thought this was hilarious because we say this all the time. So um, it can also be used not just at Christmas because it's not just Christmas colors. <laughs> So, got that let's get lit sign. So essentially it's like a cookie pan right here. And then all of the ingredients to create a Reese's Pieces cookie pie, cookie pizza thing. So, um, I got this, it was three bucks and it's actually going to be a Christmas gift for one of my friends. So, I was like, hey, it's three dollars, I'm getting it. <laughs> and the last thing that I got was from the Christmas section and it was full price, it was ten dollars. But I figured ten dollars was really affordable for this and I'm gonna put it up on my shelf right now because it's not just Christmassy. Um, I bought this, I'll tell you right now, because it really reminded me of Harry Potter. Like, everything about this just screams Harry Potter and look, it lights up. Isn't that cool? So yeah, uh, definitely got this because it just reminded me of Harry Potter and this will be something that stays out pretty much all year too. It's not just a Christmas decoration. So yeah, that's what I got. Ian's home now, but it is very late. So uh, we're gonna go to bed. I just wanted to say good night and tomorrow I'm not sure what I'm doing. I'm supposed to either go to the movies, hang out with one of my girlfriends. So um, yeah, but I'm tired. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.